for you to be out on the ice today? Uh, yeah, I mean, it was pretty special. Uh, it was more of a full practice, so uh, it was nice to get out there and kind of get it through with the whole team. Did you, did you have any nerves out there? Is it, hey, I know what I'm doing, I'll be fine? Uh, no, I think today was better. I think yesterday was a bit nervous, but today was, was a lot easier, so. Oh, and in what ways do you think, I mean, Rasmus Dahlin was also drafted first overall. He's played in this league for four seasons. In what ways do you think he could be a resource for you as you get acclimated and, you know, out with all of his experience? And um, yeah, he's, I think, someone who's been through kind of the same experience. So um, I think he's, he's someone I could really lean on and um, just try and ask him any question I can and just learn from him. What makes this group so welcoming? It seems, I mean, you've seen all your grown close. I mean, they seem to have welcomed you. Just what makes the group work, I guess? Yeah, I think every guy has just been so good, um, especially to me coming in. Everyone's been so welcoming and, um, and and so so nice to me, so they're always trying to include me in everything. So um, I think they've done a great job making it uh, easy for me to kind of come in and, and adjust. What was your reaction to getting Joe Gihari with the first partner? Um, yeah, I mean, just excited. Um, I, I've seen him play uh, when I was in Chicago. He was in Chicago, so I watched quite a bit and um, just, like I said, excited. How much communication do you think you'll have to have, you know, on the bench between shifts, you know, four games, just to say, really try to get in sync with them quickly? Uh, yeah, I think there's going to be a lot. Um, I mean, I know it's going to be adjustments, so um, to have them just be able to to talk on the ice and and off the ice, I think it's going to be huge for me to kind of um, help me in, in that adjustment. What was it like getting pushed into the middle to leave the stretch there at the end and your teammates uh, looking that way? Uh, yeah, it was, it was pretty funny, so um, it, it was all fun. I know you've had your own season, but how much have you been able to watch the Sabers, you know, the last you know, last couple of months? And what were your impressions just watching from afar? Uh, yeah, I mean, I, I tried to watch as much as I can. I think it's an exciting young group and um, a team that's got a got a great future. So um, I'm extremely excited to be here and um, to get going. I'm gonna guess you've skated in this building before. Yeah, I, I grew up in this building, so um, I've been here quite a bit. Well, and what's it gonna be like? Do you think your very first NHL game is gonna be home? against the Maple Leafs. What, what is that going to be like to have it at home against Toronto? Uh, yeah, I mean, I think it's a, ex extremely special. I think um, anyone's NHL debut is, is a really special moment, but to be able to have it um, in my hometown with all my family here, I think just makes it that much better. How do you balance this transition between leaving Michigan the way the Frozen Four happened and starting this really exciting chapter for you? Uh, yeah, just come in kind of with no expectations and just try and work hard and, and have fun. And you've only been here for a couple of days, but who have you been able to lean on so far in the middle of this transition? Uh, yeah, I think I think there's so many guys that, that have been great to me. Um, I think really anyone. Um, Oki's been, been huge to me and um, really helped me a lot. So um, I think him and really just anyone um, has been awesome. And after practice today, what, what do you feel that you need to do to be able to make this transition and get ready for NHL skill every night? Uh, yeah, I think just go out there and, and play my game. Um, like I said, I know it's going to be an adjustment, but um, I don't think I, I need to change the way I play. I, I think I'll adjust on the fly and um, just go out there, play my game, and have fun. I'm sure you're less confident last... having been at the Olympics, played in that World Junior, those two games, and going back to college. More confidence? Uh, yeah, I think the, the Olympics and World Championships, especially, have um, gave me more confidence coming in here, just playing against pros, and I, I kind of know um, a little bit what it's like. so. Um, I think those those two experiences really um, have helped me. I know it's hard to get over what happened in your last game at Michigan. Is this a good thing that you're able to jump into the next thing right away and maybe help you get through that and over it? Uh, yeah, I think so. It was um, obviously really tough, but um, knowing, I, knowing I had this coming and um, was out of there pretty quick, I think it made it, it, made it easier. How many friends and family's tickets did you give away last night Who or for tomorrow night? Who were you expecting in the building? Uh, I think there'll be a lot. I, I got my mom um, on duty for that, so <laughs> I, I don't know the exact number, but there'll be a lot. And how excited do you think your parents were to be sitting here watching you in a Sabre uniform? And this rink, as you said, you've been in it a lot. They've been in it a lot. Yeah, I think really exciting. So um, obviously it's going to be a real special moment for them as well. So. Um, I wouldn't be here with, without them, so I think they're they're really excited, and I think that's the same with the rest of my family. Obviously, tomorrow's going to be special, but was that kind of a full circle moment to be in an NHL uniform and out on this ice where you grew up? Uh, yeah, I think so for sure. Um, it's it's pretty cool um, being here in, in Toronto for um, kind of my first stretch, so um, it's definitely a special moment. What's it going to be like? 
Sorry? Uh, yeah, I mean, obviously it's a huge market, so um, pretty much hockey's everything in Toronto. What's it going to be like the first time you're on the ice with Matthews and Martin? Uh, yeah, I, th I think it's going to be pretty cool. So um, I'm excited to see where they are or how they are and um, just trying to go out there and, and play my game. How impressive is it the way Matthews has blown up here this season? Uh, yeah, I mean, he's a pretty incredible player. So um, the amount of goals he's putting up is... Um, pretty, pretty insane. So, um, yeah. What was your favorite fan moment growing up? Uh, I don't know. I think I think a lot, but um, I don't know if I could name one exact one. But there's definitely been tons. Yeah.